Guys, would you believe it if I told you that this modern house has been painted by mud and cow dung? Yes, it has. Now, I came across this video and it was really fascinating because I thought to myself, we keep I keep talking about how we as Africans can be able to go back to our culture, our indigenous culture and, and indigenous heritage and use this indigenous knowledge, especially in the area of African architecture, to be able to uh, find innovative ways um, of improving that knowledge so that it can serve us even in modern day world. Now, this is one way. Uh, I mean, look at this. Just the other day, this I believe this was yesterday, I did a video uh, celebrating the Maasai women uh, who reside both in Kenya and in Tanzania uh, and their enormous contribution to their community because all along, all through, they have been the ones who have been responsible for, ma for making sure that their community has housing. So all the houses in the Maasai community are built by women. And one key thing that they use for building, if you saw that video, is that they mix, wa they mix water, mud, and cow dirt. And I came across this video and I thought to myself, oh my God, this is literally what I'm talking about. That you can use indigenous knowledge, indigenous, um, um, indigenous, that you can use indigenous knowledge, especially in the African community, uh, and apply it in modern day world. Can you imagine that this house, this modern house, has actually been built, uh, has been built in the modern way, but then it has been painted inside and outside with mud and cow dung. And it looks pretty good. This is how it looks before it is actually uh, painted, and this is how it looks when it's fully painted, really sweet, really nice, really natural, uh, very inviting, very earthy, non-expensive, eco-friendly. It's just so simple.